Hey, what's up, everybody? Here to bring another review to some special look of the CJ Custom Cloak from Cloak, uh, as in Cloak and Dagger, for the Marvel Legends mod. And let's get started. I want to start by saying this cloak is amazing. And first and foremost, shout out to CJ. Congratulations to you and the missus on your new child. Hope you have a blessed one. I hope everything is well. And hope everybody uh, tells them the same thing. Um, for real, uh, congratulations, man. But um, let's get into this wonderful cloak. Uh, mine is a prototype to test out the new, bigger, better, cooler thing. So as you can see how the cloak figure has released, and I have used that body as the base, and it looks wonderful. This actually takes uh, two parts to do it. So one, you start off by using the Luke Cage head. It's going to be covered almost all the time. So once you pop that hood on, you won't even notice that it's a uh, cloak half the time. As you can see, it's pretty much modded. The cloak body is actually really dope. It's translucent. It's really nice. It's a perfect shade of black. That blends in with your lighting needs, especially the hands and arms being mostly translucent. It's really dope. I love this. But the cloak itself is really nice. It's wired. It's long. It's gigantic. And for those of you who are wondering, it's wired all the way through, and all the way around. On the back side, you actually have uh, the lining going across. So that way, no matter what you do, no matter how you fold it, it looks really, really nice. Now, as far as the head goes, and I'm going to attack pop this off real fast so I can uh, show you guys the cloak without the body the cloak is a nice black on the inside and on the backhand side it's knitted really well it's wired in here as well oh, it's wired in here as well so what's happening is if you want to close it up whether you want it to fold over and down you can it's done really really well so even if you wanted to get your uh, Doctor Strange on, it's your cloak of uh, <laughs> the cloak of levitation, it's actually all done really well. And honestly, I'm trying to figure out how many people like actually fit in this cloak from jumping out of it, because it's it's done to the point where it's large enough for the character and an ensemble to be inside. So I'm not gonna put a head on, but let's say I'm putting the body on now. Let's have this drop. So. This is Dagger herself, and she can actually fit as if it, she was in the Dark Force dimension. You can see here, it covers about the span of her entire body. So this is a lot of area to fit characters coming in and out of, and I think that's really dope. This video is not going to be very long. It's just me covering the cloak, and it's actually done really well. So shout out to CJ yet again. It is perfectly symmetrical. It lays down. You can wire it, like I said. I mean, look. Let's give it folds. And voila, see? It sits, it holds, it's done really well. I'm just so happy with this. And if you're wondering why I didn't do the cloak head, I'll show you real fast. Because the cloak head is actually attached to the actual head. I haven't found a way to remove it yet because I'm not an expert at these things. But if you want it to like do this, you can. So you can just put the head on top. You can actually have a cloak head on top. So it actually works like this too, which can look cool. Don't get it twisted. It could totally work like this too. But I like the look of the real cloak. I don't like the two different uh, shades blending, but that's because I don't know how to edit. But I'm pretty sure those who know how to edit, once you get a CJ cloak, you're pretty much set, you know? This is really dope. Hopefully he's ready to put it up for pre-order and mass produce it by the time this comes out. But I wanted to make sure I showed love because CJ's always hooking it up and he wants me, you know, to show love. And by that, I mean show it off to you guys. In the meantime, guys, hope you enjoyed this. Hope you enjoyed the quick photos at the end. CJ, I've taken you up on your challenge. We'll see how many people I can put inside the cloak coming out of it. And uh, do good, be good, drink your water, guys. Later.